Hi there, we're Jess and Tom. We own Boyds of Bedford and we're here to tell you about our crowdfunder to bring Boyds back from the dead. Boyds was launched in 2018 as an offshoot of our existing business, the Vintage Suhai Company. We wanted something to represent our love of all things vintage, handmade and petrol powered and began handmaking products and accessories to sell in our existing shop in Bedford. Things really took off when we started hosting bike meets in the centre of town and we'd see up to 300 bikes come on a monthly basis, being somewhere great to meet people and socialise and of course look at the fantastic machines that were on show. At the beginning of 2020 we relocated our existing shop and warehouse to a purpose-built combined site here in Snagston. At that point we introduced an additional add-on which was Cafe Brats, a cafe offering coffee, beer, snacks uh, and a place to hang out for people into all things automotive. Things are off to a really positive start and even though we opened in the winter, we still saw plenty of footfall and built our, our following even further. Unfortunately, 2020 had different ideas for us and in March we had to close our doors owing to the pandemic. The doors remained closed for three months and that time was a real struggle for us, trying to continue with the, our obligations and outgoings whilst having no shop open was a real difficult time. But happily when we reopened in July, things looked really positive. People came back in their droves and we saw uh, again a continuation of the growth of the business. Unfortunately, if the pandemic had a big impact on boys, it had a catastrophic impact on the vintage suit art company. And this is really why we need to crowdfund. In order for us to explain why we need to raise some funds, I need to first explain how our business is structured. Boyd's was an offshoot of the vintage suit hire company, and we always knew that for the first couple of years it wouldn't make any money. Indeed, we were just investing money into the product, developing um, our brands, and introducing other products from brands that we like, such as Bike Chair, Knox, Saint, Kytone, and all of the other brands that we stock. That took a huge investment, and we knew that it would take a while to pay back. Sadly, Vintage Suit High really suffered with the pandemic. Pretty much all of our business has been wiped out for what looks like going to be an entire year. So we needed to recoup that investment and basically put it back into the business where it came from. That's meant that by closing the store and liquidating all the stock, we basically just paid back the investment of Vintage Suit High put into it. So where does that leave Boyd's now? Basically, it doesn't really exist anymore. We want to bring Boyd's back. And at our darkest time, we didn't think that'd be possible. But messages of encouragement, kind words, and offers of fundraising, etc., from, from you guys made us think, well, actually, let's give it one last shot. What we've had to do is start a whole new business separate from Vintage Suhai to keep the two interests apart. And we need a cash injection to get things off the ground. We need to raise £10,000 to relaunch Boys. But we aren't looking for charity. What we've put together is a suite of, I think, really attractive rewards for you that represent everything that's great about Boyd's, handmade and locally crafted. We've worked with our good friend Mox, Morgan, who you've probably seen here if you're a regular, to create a new creative that really talk, um, speaks to what Boyd's is all about, a vintage Triumph-inspired engine in the shape of a bee to represent Boyd's. We're gonna be hand printing that onto Raglan's t-shirts, sweatshirts, and do some art prints as well. And we would love for you guys to buy one of those and, and, and to keep it and to cherish it, to show your support for Boyd's. If you're able to raise that 10,000 pounds, that money will go towards, well, firstly, fulfilling the products that you've ordered. Secondly, investing in new products to relaunch the site. And thirdly, getting us some wheels. Unfortunately, we had to sell our van to get some money back into the business to help us survive but we really want to take the boys' concept away from Stagston and out to you guys. Our plan is to have a monthly meet, and we have a location in mind already, and we can continue what we've already started in terms of creating a fantastic socialising opportunity. As well as that, we want to take boys to all of the shows that you and we love, and bring our product out to you, hopefully allowing us to reach a wider audience. We've also set a stretch target of £15,000 and if we achieve that we will equip our van with what's needed for us to be able to continue to make our coffee. We've sold Hot Numbers coffee since we opened and it's always had great feedback, not least because of my outstanding latte art, which I know people will want to see more of. I know probably what a lot of you are thinking are, will you be reopening the Boyd shop? Well, to be honest with you, I don't think that'll be happening anytime soon. Sadly, the amount of money we need to reinvest in Filling it with stock and staffing it just simply isn't available, especially with Vintage Suhai struggling as it is. Our dream 
is to open a brand new location. But that's a little way off yet, and we need to get over this first hurdle. So that's it. We're asking you to hopefully buy something that you like to help us continue to develop product, continue to have meets, and continue to be a social hub for us all to enjoy. We know that it might not happen. I totally get that. Money's quite scarce to come by at the moment. But we wouldn't have been able to sleep at night if we didn't give it one last shot. So do us a favour, hopefully treat yourself to something. We will get those out to you by Christmas if you wanted to treat someone to a Christmas gift. And hopefully together we can bring Boyd back from the dead. Thanks a lot.